remember remember when the wii u lacked the uh, features and stuff remember that well the the nintendo switch lacks features look at them sales though uh remember remember when uh the the wii u uh was getting late ports and that was the worst thing in the world remember that remember well the 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 switch is getting late ports and people seem to be excited and cool with that look at them damn sales though remember remember when people were doing movements for the wii u to have voice chat and competence and stuff and and now look at the switch and its voice chat situation remember that look at them damn sales though remember remember uh when wii u didn't have a uh, a lot of major uh, third party support and that was the worst thing in the world remember that remember and the switches not have that much major third party support either look at them damn sales though <laughs> yeah uh, what's up guys T here and uh, as the title says sales cures all man i remember i made a video uh not long ago called uh i think it was called would we you suck or something like that would it suck if it sold i think most everybody who said yeah they had you know kind of took issue with suck and i was being again facetious with the word suck uh, i was just saying you know you know with all the gripes that people had with the wii u would they matter if it sold well in the beginning would it matter and people were like, no, no, still wouldn't matter. We needed this. We needed that. And, you know, the Wii U didn't have this and this and that. And, uh, well, here we are with the Switch, and it doesn't have this and this and that. And uh, people, you know, people voice complaints or whatnot. But at the end of the day, sales cures all. Sales will drown out. Really good sales will drown out all those issues. And that's what you're seeing with Switch. And, you know, I feel like I'm right about that. You know, I, I said that from the beginning. And... You know, Switch has a lot of awesome things about it. I love my Switch. This is not about that. This is about me pointing out um, what I feel like is, I don't know if hypocrisy is the right word, but what I feel like is a valid point about how sales can, or how good sales anyway, can fix um, a situation that is... Uh, that would otherwise be terrible. Obviously, the features thing, um, the uh, the port situation, the Wii U ports coming to Switch, likely going to continue. Um, the online situation, which is, t at least to me, is worse <laughs> than Wii U. Because there were some games that, you know, you could do uh, online voice chat with in the game itself. You didn't, need, you didn't require us uh, an app on the side you know not not only that but at least messaging like you can message people people who friend request you or they can actually leave a message on the wii u where you know who they were <laughs> you know because it's hard to tell that just by a name and an avatar because a lot of people's avatars are the uh zelda ones or whatever the stock ones are and everybody's named roy you know everybody you can't you don't know you know sometimes who who's asking for the friend request so being able to just message somebody and say hey this is me blah 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 i'm a subscriber of yours or um, this is me we talked on this we played this game something like that would be cool and the switch can't even do that um and to me that's my that's the biggest most glaring thing as far as a uh, feature set and online and stuff so but i'm i'm right <laughs> like i said the switch uh or any console uh, could weather the storm if it's selling if it's not selling then people start to pick it apart and uh those arguments stick where you know people who picked you know occasionally pick apart switch the arguments don't stick because hey look at them sales though look at them sales <laughs> and I'm, i mean i'm mostly fine with that um because, you know, I, I feel like all those things will be fixed. Uh, I don't know how much better the online situation will be uh, as far as the apps go or what can you do off the console itself. Uh, but I think, you know, messaging will come, although I think it should have been there day one uh, with the fact that we don't have any other way to communicate with people. At least day one, we didn't have any other way to communicate communicate with people. So 
that's something I feel like should have been there day one. And, uh, you know, there's other things like, you know, Netflixes and all that stuff, which I don't really care that much about because I don't want to wear out my switch with that stuff or I don't care to wear out my switch with that stuff. If it comes, it's fine. Obviously, I, I'm not going to use it. So, yeah, I mean, good sales cures all. And it's not only just good sales. Obviously, the thing is selling well. Uh, for one, the form factor is a great thing and it's getting consistent games. And, uh, you know, that is important as well. So it's not just, you know, there's reasons for it selling well. When something sells well, you tend to not focus on what's wrong with it, you know. Or if you do focus on it, it's in it's not in such a harsh negative light. So, yeah, that's it for this video. Let me know what you guys think. Do you agree uh, that uh, sales can cure all uh, for the most part? Or you just think this is just a unique situation? Let me know in the comments below. As always, thank you for watching and listening. And I'll see you fools next time. Peace out. Oh, yeah. One more thing. Play Nintendo, fools. Dude.